Welcome to the channel. In today's video, I will be talking about the Lovable Dot Dev. It's an AI coding tool, innovative application designed to streamline the software development process, particularly for non-technical users. It allows individuals to create functional applications simply by describing uh, uh, what you need, what the idea is in natural language. Okay, with its promised rapid development and user-friendly interface, Lovable aims to democratize app creation, making it accessible to wider audience. So let's talk about some key features before we go jump into the platform itself. So uh, it's a natural language processing. Users can describe their projects in plain language and Lovable translates these descriptions into a functional code, uh, significantly reducing the time and effort required to, for development. It's rapid prototyping. The platform enables users to iterate on their designs quickly. Feedback uh, uh, can be integrated in real time, allowing for immediate adjustments and improvements. It's a one-click deployment. Once satisfied with their applications, users can deploy it uh, with a single click, simplifying the launch process. It's a collaboration tool. Lovable includes features for team collaborations, allowing multiple users to work on a project simultaneously and manage changes eff effectively. Uh, code ownership. Users retain full ownership of the code generated uh, by Lovable. It supports integration with GitHub, enabling seamless version control and project management. And is also backend support. The app is compatible with various databases and APIs, providing flexibility for developers to connect their applications with uh, existing systems. So what's the user experience? Okay, feedback from users highlights several strengths of uh, Lovable. It's, uh, its speed and efficiency. Many users report that Lovable allows them to create applications much faster than traditional coding methods. They appreciate the ability to generate prototypes quickly and uh, validate ideas without extensive uh, technical knowledge. It's intuitive design. The interface is designed to be user-friendly, making it easy for individuals without a programming background to navigate and utilize its features effectively. And quality output. Users can note that the applications created through Lovable not only function well, but also adhere the best practices in UI UX design, resulting in a aesthetically pleasing products. So what's the target audience for this particular one? Okay, so Lovable caters to a diverse range of users. Product teams um, uh, non-technical members can contribute effectively by building prototypes that align with team goals. Founders and indie developers, startups can leverage Lovable to launch products swiftly, minimizing the time to, mar uh, time to market. And designers, product designers can bring their concept to life without getting bogged down by technical details or extensive prototyping tools. Okay, so now we, uh, when we all know all of that, let's go quickly to the pricing. Okay, pricing is very pretty straightforward. It starts for free. You can upgrade to get the capacity that exactly matches your team's needs. So starter plan it's for twenty dollars. And it's a perfect for hobby and occasional users. Uh, it's everything in uh, free plus. Uh, go beyond daily limits with a monthly limit, okay, and unlimited private projects. Uh, for pricing of fifty dollars, a so-called launch, okay, for individuals working in a small projects, everything in a starter plus uh, 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 2.5x uh, monthly limits. And if you want to scale it, you can, you can pay them $100 and you will get uh, for uh, everything in launch and plus a larger message limits, early access to new features and VIP events. And also there's enterprise pricing here. If you want to go and talk to the guys, they probably will be able to give you some sort of custom, uh, custom pricing, okay? So look, it's very pretty straightforward. Now I'll be logging in and I will be showing you quickly how it's working. Okay, so now we are inside the application itself. So let's say that we want to do a project called, we got a few options. Definitely we can put some sort of prompt if we have idea of the applications we want to create. But let's say that we want to use one of those pre-made templates, okay? Well, it's not like a template, it's just an idea what you can achieve with that, okay? Uh, we can go ahead and create portfolio tracker 
all right so let's go for it okay and this is the prompt and you can obviously you can come up with your own prompt uh, uh doing any whatever applications you you are planning to do okay but this one is actually quite pretty straightforward so i think we're gonna start with this so what it says it's helped me to uh, get an overview of my crypto assets by making an app that uses the coin cap api for data ranks assets by market cap let me click on asset and see details including graph with its uh, price development as uses a strong neo brutalist team okay so you also what you can do it's um uh, uh, you can add attach some sort of files like if you want to go ahead and i don't know you get an idea of some sort of you know what type of team do you want to use what type of um, images a uh, like lovable can read images okay so bear in mind here it's very uh, it's very powerful you can definitely put something in if you have uh, something in store you can definitely attach to it but let's say i'm happy with this one okay and let's go and try it to create something for us all right look how quickly that thing is okay it's spinning the, up the preview already okay and it those are steps here which they are showing what the is creating for us all right and here at the uh, you know you're just chatting uh, with this uh, application the way like you'll be chatting with chat gpt perplexity uh, cloud uh, or any other tool okay so let's read it quickly what it says. So I will help you create a, a crypto assets tracker with a new brutalist design aesthetics. So let's break this down. It's design inspiration, okay? So there you go. And it's all about uh, the, the design inspirations, features for version one, main page, you know, detail page for each asset, uh, design elements, colors, uh, typography, animations, and so on and so forth. So let's implement this, right? So there you go. And here on the right hand side, you see the code right away, okay? So first, let's set up uh, our style configuration and create our components, okay? There you go. You got already the code, it's there. And now it's working on the other bits and pieces uh, for, for our application, right? So the first one has been created, okay? We know what the code is behind it. And now we got uh, this one, this, it's the front end of our application. I think it's amazing within the next like within the minute maybe two we got a full back end and a front end of our applications okay and we only came up with the idea it gives you everything you know what even the the, the color palette it, it, they're gonna use it okay the topography animations everything is there and it, they're chatting with you the same way like chat gpt is doing that okay so let's say i've created a new virtual crypto tracker with real-time data from coincap featuring responsive grid layout little asset views with with price charts and dramatic uh, uh, Hoover effects. Is it not amazing, guys? What do you think? I think it's actually pretty straight uh, forward amazing. Look, because let's say that you will have an idea of your applications, okay? Anything like weather, like weather applications, you know, fitness application, anything like that. So then you want to go and create that application. What you will need to do, you need to go on the places like Fiverr or, or, or you know, like um, uh, Upwork and uh, hire somebody. It, unless you know how to do it yourself but let's say that you don't know how to code you need to go and hire somebody to actually come up with the first uh, uh, to come up with the idea like you got an idea but they need to come up with some sort of uh, you know a template and then they will do some sort of coding in the background to create that application for you okay it takes days if not weeks sometimes even months okay plus it costs you so much money right here within the minute you got everything in, uh, uh, ready for you to use right you got a back end you got a full code which you can use and you get a front end you know how your application is going to look like let's say that obviously you want to do some improvements that's absolutely no problem at all you just go and start doing typing what you want to change with this application and the thing the, the thing will change that all together okay so let's say that i want to add bitcoin tri uh, uh, ticker on the top of the page right so let's see what it will come up with okay so the love is thinking about my idea what i want to add it on okay it's analyzing it okay so lovable already came up with uh, uh, with the response to me it says i will add a bitcoin trigger on the top of the page that shows the current bitcoin price using the existing uh, uh, api infrastructure there we go perfect added a bitcoin trigger component that displays the current bitcoin price and 24 hour price change at the top of the main page i think it's quite amazing right you see it's a bitcoin ticker over here okay and it's uh, it's so, something which if you click click here there is a full code right it's a full code for you to know what it's been done okay on the back end 
Plus, if you want to go and share that on the GitHub, you just go and click on that page here, view on that button here, view on GitHub. And if you connect that to your GitHub account, it will automatically will create all the depository on the GitHub all the files all the folders will be transferred over and then you can work away on the keep cup you, you can do your own amendments you can share that with your team i think it's quite amazing guys you know this thing is really revolutionized the the, the app creation process for example if somebody wants to somebody like yourself have an idea of the applications i would not wait any longer just go into lovable i'll be leaving the link, the link inside the description of this video and start testing it testing it out okay Okay. look it's free of charge to start testing but this one i created free of charge it doesn't it didn't cost me anything you know it's um, it's something which they gonna give you the uh, uh, the you know opportunity to test it out before you will spend the money with them okay so i think it's a great plus uh, of this project as well so guys i think that's all what i want to cover in this video if you like it please hit the like button any comments leave it down below if you can subscribe to my channel it will be much appreciated and thank you very much once again